Hmm. So on Sports Time with Smoothie Smith, what should we talk about? Oh, what's the big topic? The Badgers beat Michigan State. I don't give a fuck. B. J. Cutler. Oh my. You see, the Bears, they should have their new model. Lions, Packers, Vikings, J. Cutler. Oh my. Lions, Packers, Vikings, J. Cutler. Oh my. Yes, now I'm referring to the Wizard of Oz. But that's how they are right now. He sucks. Okay? This is a guy who came from Vanderbilt. And everybody said, oh, he's going to be the next good thing. He went to the Broncos, yeah, yeah, yeah. He did some good things, yeah, yeah. Made it to an NFC Championship game, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then, he goes to the Bears, signed a whoop-ass fucking, whoop-ass deal. And in my mind, I think the Bears are saying, what the hell did we do that day? We signed a guy for whatever it was, so he can... Make our team even more shitty. You see, the Bears haven't made the Super Bowl. Have, have never made... Have, have, have made the Super Bowl, but they lost the Tony Dungeon. And the thing of it is, it always swells my heart that Chicago still sucks. I mean, the Cubs, that's a different thing. But the Bears, they haven't had a team since 1985. What good can come out of the Windy City? I mean, the Bulls are good. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah, they're good. They won. They won. What was it? Five or six world championships with Michael Jordan. Yep. I think it was six. Yep. The Cubs, yeah. The Cubs had their... I mean, the Cubs are completely useless by September, but this year, they're going to the World Series. Now, let's talk about the Bears. They suck. And what's, what's dragging them down? Jay Cutler. But as a Packer fan, and yes, I don't watch the NFL, but as a Packer fan from, from my early stages of life, thank you, Bears. Because Jay Cutler sucks, that means you suck. Now, I'm going to try to understand the ways of trying to get rid of them without making your team better. Now, you see, the Packers, they have problems. But we're talking about the Bears and Jacob. Now, I watched this rant with Stephen A. Smith. And I said to myself, geez, is Chicago listening? Because he's right. Jay Cutler is absolutely abominable. I mean, he, he's awful. He shows no character. He sucks on game day. And when he throws a pick, he's like, uh, oh, just another pass. No. You're losing, dude. And you'll continue to keep losing if you are the starting quarterback. Which brings back to my point. Both the Bears. I'm I'm normally a Packer fan. My family is actually, and they like Chicago getting their ass kicked by Green Bay. So you can you can let Green Bay and Minnesota and the Lions, oh my, keep winning against you if you really if, if you want that you can keep Jay Cutler. But if you really want to win a division and make the playoffs, if you really want to, get rid of him. Because, technically, he's... Oh, oh, God. What can I say? He's sort of like that. He's sort of like... I don't know. A dead skeleton, he's throwing like a dead skeleton in a coffin throwing a football. He sucks. Now I know I'm rambling on, but this is, this is the thing. I don't know where you're going to get it. Because, I'm going to make a fact here. We've had, hmm, 
since 1992, we've had two quarterbacks. Green Bay has had two quarterbacks start. That would be Brett Favre, and that would be Aaron Rodgers. Now, how many quarterbacks have the Bears had? Hmm. I can't count. I mean, I can count, but I lost count. I lost count back in 1998 when they had Dave Craig, who sucked. I mean, really. Shane Matthews. Really? Shane Matthews? Yeah, Shane Matthews. Kyle Orton. Who still sucks. I don't even know where he is. Is he in Europe? Yeah, he is. So, I mean, simple as that. So, my last point is this. And this is to the GM and the ownership of the Chicago Bears. Do you want to win the Super Bowl? Because if you do, you might want to get a new quarterback. And my suggestion is, hmm, keep Jacob, because there's not there's nothing else you can do. So maybe draft the quarterback, an actual quarterback that actually wants to play for Chicago, that actually wants to make this team better. Because Jay Cutler's attitude is just, uh, it's like a kid throwing a tantrum at a, at a, it's like a kid throwing a tantrum at his mommy at, at, the, at the store when he can't get a toy. And it's annoying. Coming from a 23-year-old. So, good luck, Bears, and keep losing because this is fun as hell.